from the students of Penn State Meteorology, here is your Penn State Campus Weather Service forecast. Good afternoon, I'm Diana Apusnansky with your Campus Weather Service web forecast. Taking a live look over Beaver Stadium, we see those mostly cloudy skies with the sun starting to peek out. Our current conditions are chilly. We've got 32 degrees, but it only feels like 20 due to those winds of 21 miles per hour coming from no west northwest. Visibility is 10 miles. So as you head to class today, take your heavier coat or even your windbreaker to deal with those conditions. Temperatures across the state um, vary pretty far. We've got 20s up in the northwest corner, 30s here in Center County, and 40s down in Philadelphia, 46. But we've got um, pretty high sustained winds, 14 miles per hour up in Erie, 21 miles per hour in State College, and down in the 30 miles per hour in the southeastern state. So that's going to make these temperatures feel a lot colder than they actually are. We've got, feels like 16 in Erie, 20 here, and down into the 30s in Philadelphia. So it's impacting the temperatures with the wind. Uh, for future weather, we're going to see some snow showers moving into the area for tomorrow afternoon, a wintry mix down by Philadelphia. But um, for the rest of the weekend, it should clear out and we shouldn't see much precipitation. For today, we've got a high of 36, partly cloudy, and we've got those breezy conditions. Winds are west at 23 to 28 miles per hour. So once again, don't forget your windbreaker. For tonight, we're going to see flurries moving into the area. It's going to be less windy, but still cold, temperature 23 degrees. And for tomorrow, uh, we've got those snow showers throughout the afternoon, a high of 33 and winds northwest at 10 to 15 miles per hour. So as we take a look at the rest of the week, those snow showers Friday will be a light dusting, but they still could cause some trouble. So be careful as you make your way home for spring break. The bad weather will clear out for the weekend, but temperatures will increase into early next week. I'm Diana Aposnanski from Campus Weather Service. Have a great rest of your day.